Hey guys, coming to you with another video. Breaking news here. Authorities are looking for two people seen running from the Brooklyn scene where a ride share driver was shot in the head late Thursday. Police say according to the NYPD, the 52-year-old driver was found wounded in the driver's seat of a black Mercedes Benz on Lincoln Place in Prospect Heights around 10 p.m. Guys, you have to be vigilant, vigilant out there. I'm telling you guys, do not be picking up people that make you very nervous or you're scared. Do not do it. Women, do not be out here picking up these men. All it, all it takes is one time. I don't care if you have 5,000 rides. I don't care if you have 10,000. It takes just one time for you to never see your children again. So you have to be vigilant. Don't be trying to be no night, no no Batman night rider, Uber driver at late at night. You you are an idiot. I don't care if you if you survive. It's stupid to put your life at risk like that. If you're gonna drive, drive during the daytime in a safe area. Those five dollars is not worth your life. It's not worth it. It's stupid. I mean, I, come on. I mean, I cannot believe we've come to a point in this country where we refuse to think. Specifically, think about our safety. Just, just don't do it. Hold on, guys. Uh, we also want to update you on the investigation into an attack on a rideshare driver in Brooklyn. The NYPD believes he was shot in the head by two passengers. They're still on the run right now. News Force Miles Miller has the latest from Prospect Heights. A black Mercedes van sitting in the middle of the street at this Prospect Heights neighborhood. Police say the 52-year-old rideshare driver was shot in the head in the driver's seat just after 10 last night on Lincoln Place. He was rushed to New York Presbyterian Brooklyn Methodist Hospital, where he remains in critical condition. Witnesses reported seeing two men running away from the vehicle. I asked one of the officers what happened. He told me someone had been shot. Um, but what I find weird is that I didn't hear anything. Police sources tell News 4 there's no record of a four-hire trip at the time of the shooting. Crime scene investigators spent all morning inside the car and recovered a gun. I couldn't really see because there was glare in the window, so like all I saw them lay someone down, and I couldn't tell that there was a stretcher there because um, it was on the other side of the van, and then eventually I saw the stretcher being pulled away. I was saying to my husband, now you know what's going to happen. No cab going to want to come around here to take us where we want to go. This incident comes as crime has dropped significantly in this area, down nearly 20% compared to last year. I was in shock. It's a little surreal because I've lived here for 21 years and this has never really happened. The investigation into the shooting is ongoing. The TLC commissioner told News 4 in a statement they're assisting with this investigation and their thoughts and prayers are with the driver and his family. That's the latest in Prospect Heights, Brooklyn. I'm Miles Miller, News 4 New York. So guys, again, Uber or the police, whoever's thoughts and prayers, it's worthless. It means absolutely nothing. Nobody's going to pray for you. Nobody's going to think think about you. They're going to bury you and they're going to get the next driver and the next driver is going to do the, make the same dumb mistake because everybody thinks it's not going to happen to them. And to it does. So guys, think about what you're doing. Be vigilant. Analyze your environment. Analyze the people. You have to, if you got if you have to discriminate, discriminate. I'm not there. No one's there. We, we're not there with you to tell you that looked like a safe ride. No one's there with you. And if you have to carry, and if you have to, you know, if if you have to be in fear of your life just to pick up somebody, don't do it. You're playing Russian roulette. I told you people are poisonous. Do not go anywhere near some people, not everybody. Some people. So guys, that's it for this video. I just wanted to drop that real fast about the Uber driver. 
that was killed in, in Brooklyn on Thursday. And, um, you know, like I say, guys, it's unfortunate. You got to think for yourself, guys. It's not worth it. You have killers out here. Like, straight up. There are killers out here that will snuff out your life instantly. Then go to the Waffle House and get something to eat and not ever think about you again. So guys, do not play with these people. Take your life serious. Keep your life clean. Keep your mind clean. Keep your diet clean. Keep your car clean. Keep your home clean. Now go and conquer yourself. Peace.